Hey guys, it's Emmy here, and in today's video, I'm going to be telling you whether the Battle Pass in Honkai Star Rail is actually worth buying, um, but let's go! So if we go to the Battle Pass section um, up here, it is right here, um, obviously as you can see, all these levels are here so you can level them up. Now if you've come from Genshin, it's kind of similar to what it is in the game, but if you're not, I will just be explaining it in normal Honkai Rail terms. So what you see at the top here are rewards that you will get for free when you do today's missions, this week missions, and this period's mission. So basically like the patches mission. Um, you will get XP and then you'll get all these free rewards. So you can get some sort of wishes from here and materials and everything. And then once you get to the end, you'll just get one single wish. Now if you look below here, uh, these rewards are all locked for people who have the battle pass. Now if we go to unlock Nameless Glory, uh, that's the name of the battle pass, as you can see you can get a light cone of your choice if you get the battle pass. Now don't be confused, you will not get all of these light cones, these are just the light cones that you can pick from. You can only select one with this present here. Um, you can pick a four star light cone from here. If you really want your characters to be strong, uh, or I guess if you want to start off at the right foot, uh, I guess without having to do an insane amount of grinding, you can do it. But just keep in mind, you can't pick all of these. It will only be one. Uh, the other stuff you get is you get 980 gems. You get four Star Rail Pass special passes. Um, keep in mind, by the way, that these are only just with the premium. This is just talking about the locked currency. You will also still get the free currency, so it will be more than four. You can select one rare material of your choice, and then you can select one normal material of your choice. And then if you're confused between the Nameless Glory and the Nameless Medal, basically you just get an extra 200 gems, which is not worth it in my opinion, for an extra like 10 quid and then you get some fuel and then you get these name cards uh so if you're not really bothered about any of these which i think just for a name card it's not really worth it so if you do want the battle pass i 100 percent recommend getting the nameless glory and not bothering with this one but personally i think that extra 10 pounds could be used for the express supply pass um or you could save up for the next battle pass uh, sadly i won't be able to buy it because i have no money but um but just looking at the rewards um it will definitely give you a head start in the game uh, especially with the uh like like cones you can get you can tap on the light cones at the side to see their stats and you can choose which one's best personally i don't really know ones that are specifically good the only one i know that is good is this one has come up a lot so i know this one's good but you can do your own research see what kind of characters you have and see what would be good for them and if i'm not wrong which i may be but the next patch these cards will still be here i assume while well, thinking of the genshin pass the battle pass that if you've known that from all the weapons there are the same these are basically like weapons in honkai star rail so these cards should still be here so if you're thinking oh there are two cards i really really want you can get one and then the next battle pass you should be able to get the, the other one that you'd like but don't quote me on that if i'm wrong or something but personally i think the battle pass is worth it it really gives you a head start in the game you get uh cool rewards and as well it just gives you a motivation to like grind your levels and stuff um just make sure you know you do all your missions uh so you get all the xp you can and yeah so hope you like this video if you did feel free to like and subscribe and comment down below what you would like to see next or if you need anything uh any help in honkai star rail and if you do feel free to join my discord server it is linked down below um so feel free to join and you can ping me to ask me any questions that you might need um but yeah see you later bye